You see, I refuse to be bound. I cannot be held down because I know I've been set free. So I refuse to be condemned by you, by you, the enemy, the enemy, or myself. Or myself. I'm caught in that pride, the flesh in every path to death. Lay low, lay low, lay low, lay low. Cause when this dying breath, Christ paid my death. Lay low, lay low, lay low. I'm caught in that pride, the flesh in every path to death. Lay low, lay low, lay low, lay low. Cause when this dying breath, Christ paid my death. Lay low, lay low, lay low. Looking at the mirror, 66 books long Flipping page after page, flipping psalm after psalm Rip 51, 10, and your boy took a pause Remember that I have grace and I'm not under loud But sometimes, boy, you gotta put yourself on blast Cause living in the dirty, boy, you're bound to see cash You're bound to see ice flow screens in the dash uh, Peanut butter, leather, 24s on slab uh, This is what they push, man Everywhere I look, man Proud before the fire I'm leading by a thread, y'all. Radio with television preaching. This is why I'm high. Red Romans chapter one and learn. This is why I'm not, boy. Make no mistake, yet it doesn't take the cake. Took it knocked off the path, so I step up to the plate. Lord, hit me with that truth. Aim straight for the root. Cause really, what's the use of fine bearing no I'm fruit. caught in that pride, the flesh in every path to death. Lay low, lay low, lay low, lay low. Cause with this dying breath, Christ paid. Lay low, lay low, lay low, lay low. I'm caught in that pride, the flesh in every path to death. Lay low, lay low, lay low, lay low. Cause with this dying breath, Christ paid my death. Lay low, lay low, lay low, lay low. Lay low, lay low. Let me explain, cause it might sound strange that despite all my faults, I can still be loved by an all knowing, all powerful God in heaven who himself paid the ransom that was sent from above. Uh, some call him savior, but I call him friend. He's with me on the grind, hold me to the very end. Stay focused, must remind myself every day in case the flesh won't come and try to lead me astray. Nah, nah, but understand that this is life, not just a few moments that you hear me on the mic. Know that every word I write is subject to the light, and since my tongue's been on the boat, it's got a bad and needed Christ. Uh, so for a minute, take a look at my life, not based on what I do, whatever. Wrong, I try to write. I'm casting every self condemning thought in my mind. See myself living free in the obedience. I'm Christ. caught in that pride, the flesh in every path to death. Lay low, lay low, lay low, lay low. Cause with this dying breath, Christ paid my death. Lay low, lay low, lay low. Lay low. I'm caught in that pride, the flesh in every path to death. Lay low, lay low, lay low, lay low. Cause with this dying breath, Christ paid my death. Lay low, lay low, lay low, lay low. Yeah, homie, I'm free. Now, I know it's been a minute since the last time we talked. But I ain't forgot about you, no. Just want to let you know. I just, I, 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 I
you have at the time of your life when everything goes wrong. Pray for your life and the Lord make you so strong. Pray for the peace of the Holy Spirit. Better with the chaos, hope you feel it. Heard about the hating and I ain't with it. Gotta turn the deuce, take this baby seat. When you gotta do your third, I pray for conviction. Rather have that than your family wishing. You can be around for a birthday to Christmas. Please understand, I ain't judging a diss up. Survive, much less justify your appearance. I had what I had, what my mother could afford. Why you think my jeans was baggy and dragged on the floor? Couldn't fit them. Jordan fours, I couldn't get them. No polo logo, embroidery on my denim. I spent half my life depending on the system. White money that you had to tear out a book to spin it. Had dope money sitting at the tip of my fingers, but I stayed broke before I ever killed somebody to get it. I wasn't raised that way. Probably because my grandmother prayed that way. So I stayed that way. Proverbs 28 explains how being in the position of the poor ain't always a bad thing. Especially when it is only for a season. Because that Proverbs 13.4 will get you eating. I'm eating right now. But see, that could all change. Sometimes life is back and forth just like a basketball game. And I'm out here on the court. And I'm staying in my lane. I know God would never change. And for that, I give him praise until it all. And even if it never... Until it all And even if it never Until it all And even if it never Until it all If it never fades, great But if it fades, hey I'm used to my life in a seesaw state And I see soft states increasing death rates Closed caskets, drastic, no face I got brothers faded away, no jump shots Just dum-dums from the gunshots It was something about the California true riders Looking up to my big homies, who riders? Old Siders, Esco, South LA, the whole SoCal Why I used to play safe? Nah, we was never that, but we had each other's back What we call love, it was much 
pay the brunt of that. Didn't know better cause we didn't know Christ. God came as a man and lived the perfect life that we couldn't. Died and rose and we wouldn't. Why? Payment for sin is death, that's why the body's kept. But we got a savior who gave up the ghost. Yeah. Then bodily ascended, he did it, the Lord of hosts. So yes. what do I need? Only he who intercedes. Who died for my imperfect word, thoughts and deeds. Amen. Retired, I rest in the work that's required. Ooh. That's satisfying, our possessions or attire. Uh-huh. Still thankful for what sits on my tires. Hey, blessed by what's given to me and that'll be till it. And even if it never, until it all, and even if it never, until it all, and even if it never, until it all, and even if it never. For you, Daddy. Even though I never knew you, I love you. And I know you're still drinking, but I can't judge you. But I wish that we could have a relationship someday. I dedicate this to you. On my island, I'm powerless to change without the Holy One. I accept it in my heart, you are the risen son. I give it all to you because I cannot run. About a gun, living life on the rocks, put that in my red rum. Dead gum on my shoe heel, spending all my new bills. Just like that, 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 I come and get a refill. Sip that like we caught the big bus, now I'm distilled. Ask me how I know because it spoke and told me, be still. Instilled his word, now I'm spinning in my free will. Jesus takes the whip, now I'm riding in my good will. It's a cold world when you're driving in that alcohol. Life in moderation, you ain't got a cannon ball. You ain't got to drink it all, cause your friend said, do it. I know that it was a drunken womanizer and he blew it. He ain't gotta be that same man, you can break through it. Yo, yo, mic check, mic check, one, two. Hey, yo, uh, what's going on, everybody? And everybody's, uh, everybody on here is looking forward to the, uh, to the interview with, um, with Chili and, um, Solo. They'll be getting on here in a second, man. Just, uh, just waiting for them to call in. But, uh, just, uh, wanted to, Hop on real quick, man, and just open up with some prayer, and then also just to, you know, ask everybody, if you would, man, just go ahead and, um, if you would, just go ahead and ask everybody uh, to go ahead and um, share this, share this link. However you're watching this video, um, whether it might be through um, Ustream for the iPhone and iPod, iPad users, um, if you're watching on Forgiven TV uh, directly in our website, um, you can share that link, or then if you want to share it through our Operation Cloud link, you know, all those links are up and running. So if you guys would, man, just let somebody know. Let somebody know that we're on here. We're about to uh, we're about to go live with them as soon as we as soon as uh, we get the call. But uh, I did just want to open up with some prayer, man. And um, and uh, like I say, just ask everybody to share the uh, share the link and uh, let somebody know. So uh, that way they can hear uh, the interview as well. So, hey, man, Father, we thank you for today. We thank you for all you're doing in our life, God, and leading us up to today. We thank you for uh, raising us up for such a time as this and allowing us to be here. And uh, Father, as we just uh, begin this uh, this this segment of Forgiven TV, God, we just ask that you would uh, just be with us. Uh, help us to uh, just uh, uh, help this this uh, ministry and this form of ministry, God, through this radio program, Father, to be able to just uh, help reach someone who um, doesn't know Christ, God. And that's um, that's our goal is to uh, just uh, not just to entertain, God. We want to be used however you see fit, Father, to help uh, reach people with with uh, with the truth of your word and to share uh, Christ Jesus with others. And so, uh, God, as we do so, we thank you for what you'll be doing here tonight. And uh, we give you praise and glory in Jesus name. Amen. Amen. Hey, um, so uh, we'll go ahead and get it cracking. Uh, let me know, you guys give me a mic check or whatever, man. Let me know if you guys can uh, can hear me okay. I'm gonna uh, play a little bit of music and we're gonna bring uh, we're gonna bring Chili in here right now. So give me one second. Hello. Hello. Hey, 
either. Nope. Nope. Why is this going on? Yes, sir. Couldn't call in. Yeah, have him call. He can call in. There he is. There he is. There he is. Hey, man. Hey man, appreciate you guys. Appreciate you guys calling in, man. No man, it's straight, man. We just getting everything started. Tell everybody that uh that you guys were calling in so they can um, you know share it on their social media or whatever. Yeah man, I'm gonna go ahead and plug y'all into the uh to the soundboard here and then we'll go ahead and get it cracking. All right, well, praise God, man. Hey, um, we got Chili and Solo on the phone, man. Uh, Chili and Solo, man, get everybody a shout out, man. You got some people tuning in to hear, hear you guys. What's up with y'all? What's going on? It's Chili Baby in the house. What's up with it? It's Mr. Solo, the coach. What's up, beloved? Hey, man, praise God, man. Hey, man, like I said, man, I just I appreciate y'all making time to get on with us, man. How y'all been doing out there, man? Oh, man, we've been grinding, man. Hands to the fly. <laughs> you I, know what I mean? No, I know what you mean. I've been seeing y'all, man. Y'all making a lot of moves. Y'all just came out, came out the woods and just started banging hard, man. Every everywhere I look. <laughs> we try to get it in, man. You know, it's about to be 2014. You know, that's gonna be a big year. You know what I'm saying? I think the Father's gonna, um, you know, pour out a blessing, man, for a lot of people. And, 2014, I think a lot of hearts are going to be changed, man. I think a lot of uh, souls are going to be coming into the kingdom in 2014, man. We just got this feeling, you know. Man, I'm I definitely know, man. I've been I've been feeling that for a long time, man. It, it's been a couple of years in my heart, man. Just definitely feeling that, you know, that the Lord's pouring out His Spirit upon all flesh, man. And it's like even more evident, more and more, the things we're seeing going on around us, man. I, I'm I'm just excited, man, seeing you guys, uh, everything that you guys are doing, man. Um, I, I was talking to Trip C, and he was telling me how you guys were out in Cali, and the next thing you know, he was posting up videos of some event that y'all were doing out there in San Diego, man, not too long ago. Yes, sir. Yeah, man, we've been moving around. We've been in San Diego. We've been in the Bay. You know, we just got uh, we just got booked for the Legacy Tour for uh, next year, 2014. September, over in Australia. Over, September, whole week of October, and, yeah, in Australia. We're working on some stuff in Brazil, so we got a lot of things popping. A couple movies we trying to get together uh, with Noel G. That did the movie with uh, Bruce Almighty and uh, Training Day. We just hooked up with him. So, man, the Father is blessing, man. You know, we we trying to get to the big screen, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, Amen. Yeah, that's good, man. That's good to hear, man. You guys, like I said, man, it's just uh, it's just definitely an honor for me, man. Like I said, um, you know, I want to get into some some questions, some questions for you guys, man, for the audience, you know, that's listening. But uh, I just wanted to kind of give a little bit of um, like my testimony on how I heard about you guys, man, and that that was back in uh, two thousand and one, I believe it was. Um, I was watching a local local uh, Christian uh, rap show called 411 mag praise tv back in 2001 man and i was flipping through the channels man i had just you know fo started following christ like in 1999 and okay. it was like right. 2001 i was flipping through the channels you know kind of checking out the christian networks and stuff you know and then 
all of a sudden I see these three dudes mobbing down the 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 beach or whatever in a boat and I'm like hold up what's up with this music what is this is this Christian music <laughs> <laughs> y'all know what I'm talking about man y'all know what's up I'll, yeah, I'll be good baby <laughs> yeah man I seen the I'll, I'll be good video man Kurt Franklin you guys you know rolling in the uh in the bands or whatever you know dipping through the streets and stuff man just having fun man you know just having fun and I you know it turns out it was christian music man it was some gospel gangsters i'll be good man and i was just from that day that was the day i discovered christian rap gospel music gospel rap music i had never known that that there was people doing christian rap music until i saw that video man wow yeah man. you know we've been pushing we've been pushing that's what we do yeah we've been pushing we've been pushing since 92 though you know what i'm saying we've been We've been on the battlefield, bro, just trying to seek and save that which is lost, man. Just using our music as a ministry tool, bro. Just to just share, share our faith, man, and the love that the Father put inside of us, man, with them. Yeah, praise God, man. Yeah, definitely, man. I mean, like I said, that was my introduction to it, man. And since then, you know, I've I've picked up all the albums, you know, that you guys have. Um, I, I remember after that, I was looking at some music. I went to the Christian bookstore, and there wasn't there wasn't very much to choose from outside of you know certain rap label. But I did find this one cat named Seven, his All or None album, and that was another one that just really introduced me to West Coast uh, gospel yeah, rap music, man. Home. Yeah, man, those those two albums, man, kept me sane for a minute, man. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> hey, man, hey, man, I'm glad God was able to, you know, use our ministry, man, to just help somebody to the next place and to their to they next stop and they walk in this faith, man. You know what I'm saying? I know a lot of people that say, man, your music got me through prison. If I didn't have your music, I would have ended up doing life. You know what I'm saying? Just because it kept their mind at peace. They were like, man, I locked up, but my gospel gangsters knowing that that. Hey, God is a God of second chance. You feel me? Amen. Yeah, and that's real well, deal, I, man. Yeah, that's all I love, man. And so that's why, that's basically why we do music, man, is just to be a blessing to people, man. You know, you put in so much music sometime and music corrupts you or leads you to a negative way. You know what I'm saying? We want to be a positive light through music. We want to be that voice of reason. We want to be, uh, you know, some people may never come to church but they will pop in the cd you feel me they will put it in when they ride you know they will listen to it while they just chilling and you know if you got some good word in there man something that can minister to their heart then hey you're doing your job yeah that's definitely true man i mean it was true for me and so um you know i know it's true for a lot of other people that i know man you know i introduce them to a lot of people's music man and uh you know, it's 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 definitely been a blessing, man. You guys were definitely being used by God a long time ago, man. And I was, like I said, I was excited, man. I think how long has it been since y'all's last album was out, man? When was y'all's last album, and um, how long have y'all been uh, waiting to put this one out? The last album we dropped, I think, was 2006, 2007. Was the flood? Was the actual actual release? The flood project was the last project we did with Alan Easton. Amen. And, and we just went through pretty much like a hiatus or, or you would say like a rebuilding period or a restructuring period. We got some business in order. We did some severing for us with group members and stuff because, you know, it's just me and Chili Baby now. And um, the Father has blessed us with a couple DJs that we can travel with. And we got the whole eight members. They all locked and ready to go. But, you know, we had to just restructure some business because we had – some snakes in the garden that we had to run out and, and clean some house and stuff. And, 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 and also we have families, too, you know. So we've been being uh, good stewards over what the Father's blessed us with seeds. So we've been taking care of that. And at the same time, doing music and ministry as well, youth ministry at our church. So we've just been grinding. Yeah, man, and that's, you know, that's one thing that a lot of people don't really understand all the time, man, too, you know, that, that family is, is really before all of the music and all that stuff, man, you got to have family in there, man, first, man, I mean, uh, yeah. I mean, definitely, man, the youth, you know, having a youth ministry and speaking to the youth, you know, that's a big thing, man, but, you know, that fa family, family got to come right behind the father, man, and everything, man, and I, I'm real big on that, too, man, and that's why, I always try to include my family in, in practically everything that I do, man, because I, need, I I want them to see, you know, me serving God. I want them to see that, man. So that's 
that's definitely definitely another testimony, man, of of uh, keeping priority straight, man. You know, so many people want to try to keep the keep the music rolling just to try to keep momentum and and uh, you know keep selling you know records and stuff, man. So that's good, man. Oh uh, yeah, definitely. It was definitely and definitely much needed too. You know what I'm saying? Because sometimes you out pouring, you pouring out, you pouring out so much, but sometimes you got to sit down and get poured into. It. Because you got to fill back up yourself. Some people running on empty or old oil. You know what I mean? Yeah. Sometimes you got to get get uh, get that, uh, that, 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 that new wine, that fresh pour, the fresh outpouring, that, 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 that second wind. Amen. Hey, man, that's real, man. That's real. Hey, man, well, um, we, we got a lot of people on here, man. And, um, you know, I know most people tuned in because they know who you guys are, man. But why don't, why don't y'all give a little bit of background, man, you guys – um maybe just let the people know who, you know your name one more time and then just uh kind of you know maybe how you how you came to christ and and some of the some of the things that uh maybe you guys have worked on in the in the past yeah. Yeah. Right, it's still there hello hello yeah my phone broke up a little bit hello yeah he's there he's there um hello? Yeah, we just had. Uh, okay. We just. I, we just broke up a little bit. I'm sorry. Are you good? Uh, come on, Solo. What you got, man? You uh, want to share some? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, actually, you, you said to share about how, how the Father brought us to the kingdom. Yeah. Yeah. Basically, that you know, introduce yourself, and then you know, uh, a little bit of your testimony and stuff, and then some of the things you worked on in the past. Okay. Well, oh, that we worked on in the past. Yeah, just some different things so people kind of know a little bit of your background and stuff in the in the music thing. Oh, okay. Well, you know, uh, you know, I'm Mr. Solo, aka the coach, and uh, I've been, you know, we've been in the music industry and the music industry. We was with Interscope Records, and we've been nominated for Grammy Dubs. We did music with from Sounds of Blackness to uh, Dawkins and Dawkins, Trinity Five Seven. Um, Papa Sign. I don't know if you guys know him, but he's a big Jamaican artist over there in Kingston, Jamaica. Oh, yeah. And uh, uh, we've done so much with Kirk Franklin. I mean, God's Property. I mean, we've been on, we've toured. We've been all over, you know. The Father's brought us all over the world, you know. Actually, you know, like he said, if you if you seek the first kingdom and his righteousness and all these things to be added, you know, we never really seek demos or record deals or nothing. We just seek the kingdom of the Heavenly Father. We just started ministering to the young people through the gift the Father gave us, which was rap. So we would just do that, and before you know it, we was on we was on the road. The Father the Father actually did it himself. We were on the road with groups who had albums like SSC, Freedom of Soul, uh, Dynamic Twins, uh, everybody that was out from DC Talk. We was we was on the road. We was moving with everybody, and the Father yeah, brought us great, all great, around great, the world. Basically, when we came out, when we first came out, actually, like, all the groups he talking about right now, all of them had albums, and we didn't have an album at all. We just had the hearts out for God, man, and just wanted to see souls saved, you know? Wanted to see people who uh, come from um, liking lifestyles that we came from, like gang banging and selling dope and shooting guns and in and out of jail and doing drugs, you know? You know, we just wanted to see people change, you know, and that's what it's about for us period in our music, you know what I'm saying? Because this titty been talking, I used to be an ex dope dealer, you know, I had four dope spots, you know. It was so bad for me, I sold dope to my mama. You know, my whole family was quote unquote uh drug addicts, you know. Uh, I'm sure y'all seen New Jack City, you know, that that was that's was my lifestyle right there, you know, and then the father, he came in, he saved me, man, filled me with his Holy Spirit. Now, I mean Ever since then, we've been we've been smashing, you know, uh, for two decades, baby. You know, it's nonstop. It's like once the father gets hold of you, you know what I'm saying, and, and you and you listen to his word and you walk in that word, not only read it but walk in it. You know, sometimes things might get hard, but you're gonna always go back to your first love. You know what I mean? And and that's the father, and that's how we are. We gonna we gonna keep grinding this music because it's souls out there that keep needing to be saved, you know what I mean? So, and we know that, and we know it's all around the world, man. You know, the youth right now is in a horrible state, you know, in some some states and some places. I was just reading, you know, the gang banging is at an all-time high. 
you know what I mean, uh, you know, teen pregnancy at an all-time high. And sometimes, you know, we the only Jesus some of these people is going to see, you know. Um, not just talking about the gospel gangsters, anybody that loves the Lord, you know. Mm-hmm. So, you know, that's why we do what we do, man. And we won't we won't never stop doing what we're doing. I mean, if some people don't like how we do what we do because they say we so. Some people think we too edgy and we too this, but, you know. Too bold. You know, somebody said we too bold, but, you know, I'd rather be too bold than too weak. How about that? So that's why us as the gospel gangsters, man, we're going to serve the Lord and we're going to keep it pushing and keep grinding this music. Um, even if the gospel gangsters stop doing music, period, and don't ever do another album, we'll always have something to do with the ministry and always have something to do with some music. You know, that's what it is, you know. Uh, it's life after music, you know what I'm saying? Amen. Amen. Definitely that, man. Definitely that. I mean, uh, the the music just opens up a door to be able to really give them what they really need, man, and that's Christ. Right. Exactly. It's a, it's a vehicle. It's a taxi, you know what I'm talking about? Yeah, definitely, man. That's, that's right on time, man. Yeah, well, that's good, man. Yeah. Go ahead. I say, yeah, see, that's what we... When we got, honestly, we honestly we set out and we accomplished exactly what we wanted to accomplish. I mean, because when we got born again, it wasn't a whole bunch of music. A lot of people tell us that y'all the first music, gospel music that I really, that we really took serious. Like, it was other Christian rappers before y'all, but we just didn't listen to them. Y'all was the first ones that we, that caught our eye, that made us say, hey, we can listen to this. And we... Honestly, it wasn't a lot of stuff for us to listen to as well, and that's what we did. We came from that era of the streets and from the, 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 the trap houses and the gangbanging and, and the hip-hop. We came from that era, so we said we want to relate to our generation. We want to speak to the to the people who in dope houses, cooking dope, bumping rap music. We want to be able to speak their language, but we want to tell them about the goodness and the, uh, the mercy of the Heavenly Father. And we did that because it's so many people that, I mean, every show we do, somebody come up to us and just share an intimate testimony. We need to document some of it. People just sharing how important our music has been through their walk with Jesus. How, if, if it wasn't for your music, I would have never came. Or I came to church and, and, and I still wasn't connected and no I, no one could reach me and somebody came and handed me one of your tapes. You know what I mean? It, it, it always blesses us to see what God has done through our music and our ministry without us even knowing. Yeah, man. And, and that's it. Uh, you know what I mean? Amen. I mean, and that's how I started this whole thing up because I know exactly what they're talking about, man, because that's real. I mean, like I said, I was two years in and I was still listening to, you know, Scarface and Ghetto Boys and all that stuff, you know, two years in, you know, serving God. Mm-hmm. But I just didn't have an alternative. I didn't I didn't know there was anything, you know, you know, that I didn't even know Christian rap music existed. Any kind of gospel rap or anything like that existed, man. I, I had mm-hmm. to settle for I had to settle for what they was playing at the church. I had to settle for the. You know, like the Ron Cannoli kind of stuff. You know what I'm saying? That exactly, was like, exactly. you know what I'm saying? Like the modern day Hill song. Back then, they didn't even have Hill song, man. You know what I'm saying? They had some old uh, integrity music or something. They didn't have hardly anything to really choose from. You know what I'm saying? I'm listening to some Reverend Al Green. You know what I mean? <laughs> trying to keep it, <laughs> trying trying to keep it. You know, at least something. You know that was that was you know along the lines of what I you know would would need spiritually, man. And so. I mean, I, I can relate, man, and that's definitely true, man. And, it, you know, that's why I say, you know, um, I, I recognize, man, you know, you guys been doing this for a long time, man. And I I mean, I want to get into the album. Y'all, you guys got this new album out, man. And um, I mean, I was telling I was telling Chili my thoughts on the on the on the music. You know, you guys, it's not like you changed the style, but it, it's got a it's got a current sound. It's got a, a little bit of a change in the sound as far as like uh, keeping up with. Uh, with the change, but really it just uh, something that we, you know, that we would expect from from gospel gangsters, man. The 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 sound, you know, the West Coast sound, the groove sound, uh, you know, and just uh, the 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 flavor of it, you know, just definitely remained, you know, true to the roots of what you guys been doing from from day one, you know, which is really bringing that yeah, West Coast yeah, yeah, flavor, yeah, yeah, man. Yeah, 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 yeah. And, and, and you know what? We go, we got some, we got some other stuff. We got some stuff that we, cause this ain't it. This is just us. 
letting y'all just, just you know, this is like the jab per se. If you if you know anything about boxing, this ain't the knockout blow. This is the jab to uh, what get your attention. Damn, but you know uh, we got more stuff. But yeah, what we did was we wanted to stamp the signature on, like you said, where we come from, where we the West. The West is kind of like a, uh, the missing piece to the puzzle. A lot of people are not, everybody run away from the West Coast sound due to the fact of, like you said, people don't stick to the ministry. They just keep putting music out to keep momentum or keep, you know, for what, like people, they don't, they do music now just to sell records. So whether they from the West or not, they going to do whatever's hot. You feel me? They just, they jump on whatever's hot and try to do that and become that. But we stuck true to what we do, even though we can, we do all, music is universal. So we do all types of music. We rap on East Coast tracks, this, that, and the other. But the gospel gangsters, where we from, our soil, our expression, our heart, you know what I'm saying? We came from the West. That's where we come from. And that's where the origin of that production came from. Yeah, man. I mean, cause uh, <laughs> like I was, I was just listening to the to the album when I first when I first picked it up. I picked it up like at twelve oh one midnight. You know what I mean? I, I was ra- I was waiting on it. You know what I mean? But but like I jumped on I jumped on that uh on that braids in and I was just like, oh man, hold on, what are they doing with this? It was kind of threw me off for a minute because I heard that singing and stuff. And so I was trying to give it a second, and the next thing you know, the beat just kicked in. I was like, oh, man, this is going to be it right here. This is the jam. <laughs> see, because I'm... God, man. Y- me. I mean, y'all can't, hey, y'all hey, can't hey, see hey. me. Y- y'all can't see me. So when you when he started talking about having braids and stuff, you know, I'm a bald dude. So, you know, I couldn't really dig it. That's what I mean. <laughs> yeah, yeah but see, right, right, it right. don't matter whatever, whatever. Whether you got braids in your hair, your beard, or whatever. But that was just our expression. But it's about worship. It's like we G'd up, but we still worship in the Heavenly Father. You feel me? Amen. Amen. That's real, you know? man. Yeah. And, 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 you know, everybody, I don't care if it's females, with the brother, whoever, you know what I'm saying? Hey, we still worship in the Father, man. It's uh, basically come as you are. You feel me? Come as you are. If you ain't got brains, you can still come worship with us, baby. Yeah. Yeah, amen, amen, and um, like I said, man, I'm gonna let y'all, I'm gonna let y'all talk a little bit more about the album, man. What kind of, uh, what kind of feedback you guys getting back on the album, man? Just from from different different sources. Well, everybody, well, man, it's it, been man. a blessing. I mean, it's, it's, I, it's a blessing. The feedback is a blessing. It's it's crazy, man. It tripped me out because the um the first time it came out, the first like you said, you bought it at twelve oh one. Bought. About time, I don't know if it was midnight then, but about time that morning, it was on front page of iTunes already. So that kind of like tripped us out because you usually, that usually just don't happen. You know what I mean? Unless you just, just like major somebody, they just throw you right up on the front of iTunes like the first day. You know what I mean? And that, that was a blessing. And then Holy Culture, they got, they wrote a, um, a good um, article about us, you know, saying that, you know, the gospel gangsters is back. It's safe to say that, you know, they love the music. They love the momentum. They love the worship, you know, you know. So we, we getting some good feedback, man. You know, uh, Jam the Hype Radio, I think he's syndicated in like 80 countries. So they playing it. So it's a lot of people playing it and a lot of, you know, sites. And yeah, a lot of people, they respect up. our lane. Yeah. You know, that's, it's a lane we got, bro. It's a lane like we've been talking to some. We've been doing a lot of interviews and people been saying, man, it's a lane that like that where y'all could reach the streets and y'all could reach the church folks. It's like a lane that y'all feel that nobody else can't feel. And I'm like, hey, man, there's a lot of people like, man, you know, I like they like they like hardcore rap and don't nothing else get them there. You know what I'm saying? They say, man, I got to bump some gospel gangsters. Or, you know, some hardcore, some Christian some hardcore. It sounds crazy, but they want some hardcore Christian rap. Mhm. Yeah, that's real deal. They like, they like, man. I came, I came up with some, you know, everything that was going on in the streets, and then when I came to the body, it was like, man, you know, it was like it was good music for the for the church, but it was nothing I could put in my car that I could roll and relate to. But I'm like, yeah, I got something for you. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's real deal, man. I'm. In the track- Go ahead. The track we did with Bootsy, the track we did with Bootsy, the Every Man, we getting a lot of good. 
Amen. So y'all getting a lot of good people. Go ahead. Go ahead. Yeah, I'm just saying Chili, is that you back on, man? Yeah, let's be back on, baby. I, I, I cut off, you know. I, I live by the mountains, baby, so uh, sometimes my phone be acting up one time. Sorry, everybody. Come boy in them hills. Mm-hmm. That's all right. You got to pay the you got to pay the cost to be the boss out there, man. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, baby. baby. <laughs> so see, you know, so 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 that's why we be praying that people support our ministry that we can get out and we can minister to more people because like i said so no matter how how much rap or how much ministry we do just because of the format i mean it's a lot of churches that still won't have rap in their church because they think rap itself i mean like we've been through the storm bro i mean the doors is open like lecrae like lecrae and all everybody else that could walk through the doors when we first came through the doors, them doors wasn't open. We had to we had to open them doors. We had to kick them doors open. We had to go uh, get the keys to those doors so those doors can be open because they was definitely shut when we first walked through the door. When we first came, they wasn't really allowing a lot of rap or any type of hip-hop into the churches until we showed that we had to get a rapport with the church. Mm-hmm. Yep. That's true, too, man. Straight up. Yeah. Yeah, but that's good, man. I mean, and um, you know, I know you guys. Um, I know you guys do get a lot of uh, a lot of spins on different on different uh, you know that are different uh, radios that are you know committed to that, man. And uh, you know, I'm just believing, man, that God will be able to open up more opportunities for y'all's music, man, because. You know, when you're like you say, you know, when you're somebody that's come from this background, man, those, those are the ones that, you know, that you can relate to. But I mean, it's like, you know, if the father came for the sick, you know what I mean? You got to get, you know, you there's going to be something that they can relate to. You know, you 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 definitely giving them the, the medication that, that can fit their bill. You know what I mean? Because it's something that they can that they can uh, digest. You know, there's something that they can uh, relate to in the style. And it's the, the the lyrical content more more than anything that's really gonna help um, you know help them renew their mind you know just by getting them and their focus talking about you know the things of God as opposed to just you know the things I mean because because regardless whether the church gonna let rap music in the church or not th they still gonna listen to rap music the kids still gonna listen to rap exactly. right. I mean, there's. Exactly. I mean, it, it's not like you know, hip hop came and went, man. You know what I mean? It, it it's been around for for decades, man. And and uh, you know, the sooner we can, you know, grab hold of it and utilize it, you know, in in the positive ways, you know, as, you know, in in the ways of God, you know, the better we get to utilize it as a tool, man. I mean, um, you know, forgiving, forgiving TV, man. I mean, that's basically all we spend. I mean, we we throw in a, a few oldies and stuff, you know, and maybe a little bit of you know some old. Uh, you know, like some Salvador or something like that, you know what I mean? That's kind of got some, you know, some Latin style to it, you know, because, I mean, forgiving ministry, you know, we, we we majority of us, if you know, most of us just ride, ride low riders, you know what I mean? So we know what sounds good in the ride. Hey, that's why, hey, that you see that song on there called Low Ride, and that's just for you. Hey. That's just for those that do low. Hey, because we wanted them, <laughs> we didn't believe it too. Man, you talking about us. We didn't believe it's out of hopper the old school 64, head off to church, man, and just drop the top, you know what I'm saying? Just go and just thank the Lord, man. We live it, man. We done made it through the storm, you know? Yeah. Yeah, hey, man. Hey, man, I was trying to, I was, that was like my one in the chamber right there, man. That song right there. 
You know, I mean, I basically just jumped straight to that song when I started listening to it. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, hey, yeah, low ride. And that's the one right there. <laughs> yeah, definitely, man. And see now, and, and when I got it, when I picked up the album, y'all made me regret selling my Regal. I just sold my Regal, man, a couple weeks ago, man. <laughs> hey, hey, uh, hey, that's my favorite. <laughs> that's my favorite. Well, I, I already, I already know. I already know how y'all do it out there, man. I seen, I seen. Uh, uh, last time I posted up something on there, and uh, you guys was checking it out. Y'all was like, "Is that y'all? Is that your car or what?" <laughs> Yeah, straight up, man. That that's good stuff, man. I mean, like I say, uh, you know, it's 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 not so much, you know, that you know that people they just not used to, you know, certain things, man. I mean, I think the traditional things of of the church is really what's going to hinder the uh, that ministry in being effective in different in different uh you know different people's lives. You know what I mean? And I, I think. It's not, you know, really that, um, you know, that it's any any fault of their own other than just the fact that, um, you know, a lot of churches, man, are really, you know, they, they're not going to say they're religious, but that's what religion, religion is. It's a tradition of man, you know, just a continued tradition, something that you always do. do. If you do something every year, you, you call it, you know, you can call it what you want, tradition or whatever, but that's religious. You keep him with tradition, you keep him with the traditional way of doing things, man, and sometimes... We need to look around and see what's really uh, going to be effective. We got to change with the times, you know, from in, in different scenarios, man. We don't never compromise the message, you know, but we might have to compromise the way that we do things at, from time to time. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah, man. But I'm, I'm excited, man, for the uh, for the album, man. You guys, uh, like I said, I was looking forward to it for a long time. You guys did like, I think, three. I think it was three different uh, promo videos leading up to it man and i was telling chili about them too man i was looking i was looking for those so that that might be the 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 counter punch that that solo was talking about you know i was looking for that uh stand up and that uh g'd up what's up what's up with those tracks <laughs> oh you talking about that g'd up stand up is on uh the exodus oh on the or, exodus or the oh, no that's on the flood album the stand up is on the flood album bro oh okay i see i need to pick that one up Yes, sir. You gotta go get that. That's on the flood album, man. Go pick that up. At, you, you can probably get it on iTunes. If not, go go to art. Right, go to Gospel Gangster. I am Gospel dot com. That's all gonna be up within the next week or so on our stuff. We'll have everything being funneled through our uh, um, website, so you can go snatch it from right there from us if you want to. Amen. Yeah. And, and also, 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 that's on. You talking about the Street Disciples? We just got a brand new distribution uh, deal. So we took that off the shelf. Uh, it's going to be re-released uh, through our new distribution company. Like I said, everything's going to go through our one distributor. So we'll have, that's where the G'd up and everything is on that street disciples. And you can get the documentary if you ain't got that. Yeah, man, tell, tell some people, because I heard a little bit about it when it was coming through. And then, I mean, it wasn't it wasn't out very long, I think, before you guys might have picked up that deal because I couldn't find it after exactly. maybe like a week or two, man. Exactly. We got a deal. So the distributor wanted to put it out, so we took it off the shelf, so they can, uh, you know, maximize the shelf life and, uh, with their system. So we finna be having it all available. So those people who are uh, down with the gospel gangsters and and our mini and our ministry uh, help it, 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 it benefits their spiritual walk, or they just want to just, you know fellowship through our ministry with our ministry is there for you i mean if you want to share that is the documentary is something you could have you could play at a youth group you could play at church you could play at the house with the family you can play i mean it's so universal to where you know you can you can just walk up and give it to rick ross for 50 cents they check this out man and they'll probably call you back and say, hey, matter of fact, I had a couple street dudes that I did do that to. And they called me back and said, hey, bro, I really enjoyed that. And these are like straight thugged out gangbang, I mean, like hood leaders that, that, that lead gangs. Mm -hmm. And they calling me back saying, man, I really enjoyed that. That I ain't never seen nothing like that in my life. Yeah, yeah, amen. I mean, and that's a vision that the, that the Lord given us too, man. If we're giving, man, we working on something like that, man. We might need to talk offline and see if if there's a way that, uh, you know, I mean, I know you guys got the the distribution and everything with it, man. But like the same thing with Forgiven Ministries, working on something where we throwing together a bunch of testimonies from different people, some you know rap artists. You know, we got uh, 
uh, people like Seven and and uh, and other people, you know, that are helping contribute. Eshawn Burgundy, Ivy Connerly. I mean, just a whole bunch of people. Even old school uh, Crow man uh, from from Grape Tree Records, man. Yeah. E- even he's helping out, man. Yeah, it's just a uh, it's a, it's a big it's a big thing that we we want to put together, man. Just to kind of uh, you know basically give away like when we go to the car shows or when we go out to the you know do street evangelism and stuff to just give people a, a DVD with just testimonies, music videos. You know things that would uh, deal with specific topics of people that we generally come in contact. You know things dealing with gang bang. You know Trip C's on there on his testimony video talking about how he was delivered from from all the gang banging and how he'd been shot. You know when he was younger and you know some of the things that he went through and just sharing his story, man. And I think you know that would be a good. Who, who, who was that? Uh, Trip C out in uh, uh, Christopher Chris, uh, Christopher Lang out in uh, San Diego. Oh, okay. Yeah, so you know, just di- different, uh, different people, man. You know, just all coming together, man. And it's a, uh, you know, and and it's another big thing that that we looked at, you know, with this project as well is just the unity of it all, man. Because, you know, so many times, you know, we working on different things, and it's like, you know, we we not doing it to sell them or nothing, man. You know what I'm saying? We we doing these and just burning thousands of them, man, and just going to be giving them away. Forgiven Ministry has uh five different chapters all over the country man and we just gonna give each chapter like a thousand copies and just say here pass them out when you go to the shows pass them out when you go on the street pass them out you know what i mean right 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 yeah we want to definitely get some stuff because this is some street ministry that definitely this stuff will bless some people that's out there on the street that need to hear it, that need to see it yeah man like i said when i seen it man and that's how i heard about it and i've been kind of looking for it man uh, when i remember but i know when it first came out i was like man i didn't have the bread to try to pick it up and then next thing you know when i did it was like it was gone and so uh mm-hmm. yeah man i'm glad i'm glad to see glad to hey, hear that that's gonna be coming out i'm gonna make sure we got we, i get your connect so i can make sure you get you a copy of that yeah man definitely i appreciate it man mm-hmm. but yeah Love so it. So yeah, that's the street. That's the, the Street Disciples documentary DVD. In case anybody just jumping in, man, uh, you know, just a quick shout out to everybody that's tuned in, man. We got people from, uh, we got some cats from up in Washington tuned in. You know, you got a lot of people from here in Dallas that are tuned in. I know Florida's tuned in as well. Uh, so a lot of people Yo, just getting Florida, on, man. Dallas, shout out to everybody. That's what gets to the spot, baby. Perfect. Yeah, Much yeah. Love. Much love to all of them. D-Town, Florida, what's up with y'all, baby? Peace and blessings, man. We will definitely up, be man? showing our faith in those states real soon. Hey, man, I'm look. I'm looking on the map here, and I see Chicago's on here. We got St. Louis tuned you know, in. Hey, you know, man. Tell them all to go pick up that album, man. Tell them to go pick that album up. Support the gangsters, man. Support the guy from gangsters, bro. Yep. You know, we, don't, we don't have no full-time jobs, bro. We, we, we full-time ministry, so... This is how we feed our fans. This is how we get from place to place. Hey, so, Amen. This is how we keep this gospel pushing, man. So if they go buy it, they hit Amazon, they hit iTunes, it will definitely be a blessing because it's going to allow us to um, help the ministry just move forward. You know, because sometimes, you know, people don't have the money for us to come to place. And if we got the money, we just spend it and go. Yeah, yeah, amen. You know, so, Buying these albums, buying these albums, you know, they definitely, uh, definitely help us. Hey man, and we hadn't forgot, man. Chili, I I remember, you know, we was talking um before the summertime, man, and um uh, you know we talked about trying to get you guys to come down to Dallas, man, and and we still want to do that, man. I I still I still really believe that God wants to use us to bring you guys. I don't know if you guys ever did any kind of shows or anything out here in Dallas, man, but we really want to do something, man. Oh yeah, we done did something in Dallas before. Amen. Definitely, we definitely trying to come back down to, to the D town, baby. We love Dallas. <laughs> we we done been all through Texas. We done been there from Amarillo to Houston to Dallas to uh, where else? We been in, in Dallas. We been to we did the uh, we been to Irving, Texas. Hey, we did the uh, South by Southwest out there. Um, I think like two years ago. Amen. Amen. That, down that was in Austin. That was in Austin, I believe, though. Yeah, down in Austin, straight up. Yeah, 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 man. So you know, Texas, like that, me and Texas strangers, love, man. We like that soil. <clears throat> me and no strangers to T Town, baby. 
Hey man, yeah, we we want to try to do something, man, and I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna talk with the club, and we're gonna see the best thing that we can do, man. We want to try to do something, man. I'm gonna try to set up something for early summertime. I told Chili what I wanted to do is I want to do like a, a car show slash concert slash water baptism, man, right there in the lake, man. You know, got to be off the chain. I love to be a part of that. I'm lo- I love I love doing all that. I, we love we love not only to work in the ministry, but we love to work the ministry. We love to. To, to be out there. We love to be out there with the people, man, because cause there's always needs to be met, man. The harvest is right, but the labor is few. You feel me? There's ain't a lot of people out there that's willing to get out there, bro. And we know that God will supply all our needs according to his riches and glory, and we're willing laborers, man, that's willing to get out there and get out. Amen. Amen. Praise God, man. That's what I'm talking about, man. I know... You know, some people are afraid to get their J's dirty, man. Y'all rock the Chucks. Y'all not scared to get them dirty, man. What's up? Amen. Straight up, man. Well, cool, man. Well, look, man, I ain't going to try to hold y'all up too much, man. Uh, y'all got any, any anything else y'all want to add on here, man? And I'm going uh, to plug the uh, album real quick, too. Hey, man. We just want to say, what? man, thanks for everybody that support the Gospel Gangster. Thanks for everybody that's been supporting us. Uh, you know, the whole length of our career, our ministry, man, we, we appreciate y'all, man, and we thank y'all for buying the hours and supporting us and telling people about us and, and keep pushing the music, man. We really, really appreciate it, bro. It's uh, We don't take it lightly, you know what I'm saying, and we take it humbly, man, that, you know, the Father, we glad the Father blessed y'all with listening ears, you know what I mean? And shouts out to, to Forgiving TV, because without y'all, it ain't no us, you know what I'm saying? So, that's straight love to every. To every city and every state listening right now to the gospel gangsters on this radio, man, just know we love y'all off top and hope to be in y'all town or be in y'all city sooner than you think. Amen. Amen. Solo, you want to add something, man? Yeah, man. Just let y'all know, man. We appreciate you, man. And like you said, without you guys, it would be no us. So we appreciate you, man, for supporting our ministry. Tell somebody about it. You got it, uh, tell somebody about it. Tell them that, uh, you know, go check out that gospel gangster. Just spread the word like you would do the gospel, because that's what it is. When you talk about the gospel gangster, you talking about the gospel because we're synonymous with the work of the kingdom. You feel me? Hey, man, that's real deal, man. Uh, and uh, like they said, man, y'all go check out uh, Defenders of the Faith. is a new album by Gospel Gangsters. Uh, Chili and Solo, man, you know, you can't say that they're back because I don't think they ever left, man. They they just got a new project out. Y'all go check it out, man. They got uh, some, I'm going I'm to say instant classics on there, man. For me, you know, there's some there's some instant classics on there. We're going we gonna, to uh, head out with one of them, that low riding track. But I'm also going to tell everybody that's, everybody that's listening, if you're listening right now, I'm gonna, uh, as soon as we get off the phone with uh, Chili and Solo, y'all don't go anywhere. I'm going to give away, I'm going gonna, uh, gonna to give you a free down, digital download of the, of the new album, man. So all I'm going to do is I'm going to ask one question, and then I'm going to get somebody to call in. Y'all give me the answer, and then I'm going to uh, I'm gonna go to Amazon and, and uh, buy a copy of the, al- the album and uh, give you the, the download link so you can get that tonight and uh, pull down the album tonight. So don't go anywhere. All right, fellas. Well, I'm going to let y'all get back to it, man. I appreciate, again, all your time and definitely the work of the ministry and the things that you guys are doing for the kingdom of Yahweh, man. You guys are doing an excellent job, man. You guys keep up the good work, man, and I pray that the Father bless you guys abundantly to continue to do the work of the ministry, man. God bless you guys. Amen. Thank you, beloved. We appreciate it, man. And keep us in prayer, and we will keep you guys in prayer as well. Amen. Amen. All right, fellas, y'all be good, man. We'll be seeing y'all. All right. Peace and blessings. All right, for sure. Shalom. Peace. Amen. All right, everybody. That was Chili and Solo, also known, better known as the Gospel Gangsters, man. Hey, uh, like I said, y'all be sure to go cop the new album, Defenders of the Faith. You can see the album cover right there on our, uh, on our video feed. Uh, Gospel Gangsters presents Defenders of the Faith. Camp 8 Entertainment, uh, 14 tracks, all of the, all of the songs, excellent, excellent songs. Um, like I said, I'm going to leave with one of them so y'all can hear it uh, before we close out. And then uh, once the song's over, I'm going to come back. I got one question. 
It related to the interview tonight. And if you can answer the question right, give me a call. I'm going to give you my phone number. You can call call me up. You give me the answer on the air. And then I'm going to give you a free digital download of the album tonight. Tonight. Okay. So let's go ahead and go into this one track real quick. And I'm going to give everybody a minute to listen to this album. If y'all have a free, if y'all have a free hand or a free uh, web browser or tab or something, you can go over to Amazon.com. You don't want to wait. You can go pick up the new album there. Or you can go to iTunes on your iPhone, your iPad, or whatever, and download "Defenders of the Faith" by Gospel Gangsters. Y'all check this one out. Count him worthy of my praises. I rock stages, my face seems contagious. I'd rather live right if death would be sin's wages. The ghetto prophet duck when the heat blazes. Nonsense. Who can then sermons in street races? Who can meet Christ and turn from street life? Then sit in church to learn and return to speak life. Long as my heart beat low, I never see the feet. Somebody can't take it, I never let them see the heat. But to live is Christ in the dies of a last. So never get in my way when I come through smash. So many wanna be in the city of G. Low ride, bumping through our DD on D. No love snitches, but we pity they please. And if you're scared to ride, only give me the keys. We low ride. <laughs> Throw up your hands and bob to it. Going off the swab fluid. Learn to praise God to it. That's how I do it. Forget trying to be them. I'm trying to be me. And that's consistent yeah. trying to be him. Follow the man and they murder. But I'm gang for the worst. To proclaim his name in the turf. What a dangerous lurk. Short change is work. Blow his brains on the shirt. Homies locked up as long as they remain on the turf. Insane and berserk. That's why bullets rang and I smirk. Cause before I came in the church, I was banging the turf. I seen it before. Tricks give his green to a whore. Fiends on the floor with needles by the beams of the door. To even the score. He I ain't seen it before, a vision the bedroom, looking like the scene of a war. And for sure, if it was, I'd be the first with a nine out. But it ain't flesh and blood, cuz you need to find out. So many wanna be in the city of G. Low ride, bumping through our D.O.D. Don't love the snitches, but we give you that please. And if you're scared to ride, we give you the keys. We low ride. Low ride. Low ride. Low ride. Hit the stage and gladiate. Suckers hate it cause I made it. Wanna see the homie terminate. Like the son of Sarah Connor. Logan, the potent marijuana. When I can't even bear a son, how the hell I'm a bear show? I make lyrics repair souls. See, I tell stories rare told. I take them back to the garden. When men's heart was first hard. Nowadays, these birth larkins. I'm playing in their harkin', but the church lights are darkin'. Cross me, ride. You don't know what you'll be starting. I'm a child of God, never smile when I mob. But catch me on the prowl with a squad. Dick, so many wanna be in the city of Jesus. Low ride. Bumpin' through our D.O.D. Don't love the snitches, but we pity they please. And if you scared to ride, we give you the keys. We low ride. Low ride. Low ride. Low ride. So many wanna be in the city of Jesus. Low ride. Bumpin' through our D.O.D. Don't love the snitches, but we pity they please. Hey, man, hey, uh, <laughs> I forgot the news was still kind of fresh to people, man. People hitting me up about the Regal. They're like, what's up with the Regal, man? I didn't know you saw the Regal, man. What you thinking? It's all right, y'all. It's all right, man. I got, some, I got something coming for y'all. I got something else coming. It's all right. <laughs> you got it. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying, uh, baby Moses. You know what's up? You know, you know. You got to make room for something. You got to get out with the old and in with the new first, man. You got to get something out the way to make room for the new stuff, man. Can't keep holding on to everything, man. Got to be a blessing at some point. Let it go. 
Hey, man. Well, uh, let's see. I'm going to put something back on here. This is the song they was talking about that every man. But, yeah, man. So, uh, anyway, I told y'all I was going to have one question. So, I got it. So, if y'all are ready, I got one question for you. I got one question for you. And if you call me right now, I'm going to give you my phone number, right? I'm going to give you my phone number here in a second. And, and if you're part of Forgiven Ministry, you can't win. So don't try don't try to, you know, try to jump in a line or whatever and call me, you know, now and then be like, oh, wait for the question. I'm going to make it fair. Okay. going to make it fair. If you're listening right now, I want you to win a free copy of the uh, Defenders of the Faith album by uh, Gospel Gangsters. And so here's how you do it. I want you to call me right now. And you got to give me the answer, the correct answer to this question. The question is, during the interview, we talked about something specific. And I want to know what is the name of the DVD documentary that's out by Gospel Gangsters that they're going to be releasing. What is the name of that project? If you can tell me the name of the project, you win a free digital download of the new album, Defenders of the Faith. You got to call me right now. My number is 214-796-4255. When you, when you call, you're going to have to be on the air and give me the answer so that way we can make sure it's fair. All right? Call me right now, 214-796-4255. And if you have the correct answer, you will win a free copy of Defenders of the Faith album by Gospel Gangster, the digital download. The question is, what is the name of the DVD documentary put out by Gospel Gangsters? That's going to be released. It was re previously released and it's going to be re-released very soon. First one to call me with the correct answer will win that free digital download. All right. I'm waiting on my phone to ring. Where y'all at? Nobody knows the answer. <laughs> Still waiting on that winner, man. All right, y'all, y'all got till 10 o'clock, man. If y'all can think of it, go Google it or something, man. Get on there and figure it out. What is the name of the DVD documentary that was put out by the Gospel Gangsters? It's currently off the shelves, but it will be re-released very soon. Yeah, see, I got somebody from Forgiven Ministry calling me right now. Hold on, hold on. Let me see. I'm going to put him on the air right now, too, and see what he's got to say. Hang on. Y'all want to hear from him? What's going on? You're on Forgiven TV. What's cracking? What's going on, man? <laughs> What's up, man? You're on Forgiven TV. What's cracking? This year, like can win it. Even though I'm part of Street Disciples. Street Disciples. I don't know. What do y'all think, man? Y'all think we should give it give it to uh, David Flo? This is David Flo from Forgiven Ministry, man, the president of Forgiven Ministry, Texas chapter. <laughs> now nah, you good man i'm gonna get it to you man everything all right yeah man everything's fine man all right cool man if i'll, I'll do this man i'll do this man because i want i want to see if anybody else out there is listening that wants to try to win if you can if you can call in right now and you got to get on the air and let us know 
the uh what is the name of the dvd documentary i think he already i mean he already gave y'all the answer so i think it can't be any easier than this uh you just got to call in get on with us tell us the name of it and i'm gonna get you a copy of the dvd too so how's that <laughs> cool man <laughs> Yeah, I appreciate it, man. You you, you yeah. helped me from keep, keeping me hanging and, and having nobody come in and call in and win. He said, man, I'm not going to leave that free CD out there. I'm going to get that. <laughs> I said, might as well. <laughs> hey, man, well, at least I know somebody was listening, man. That's cool, though. Oh, hold on, hold on. I got somebody else calling. Hold on, I'm going to put you on three-way. All right. What's cracking? You on Forgiving TV? What's going on? Forgiven is excluded. Forgiven is excluded. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man, come on now. Y'all gonna have y'all gonna have me buying copies of this album for everybody and forgiven. I gotta I gotta hit up. Uh, I'm gonna have to call Frank out there in Cali, Omar and Johnny up in Washington. I gotta get Danny a copy and his son Jason a copy. <laughs> I'm going to be like, dang, oh, I done spent $300 on album downloads for these guys, man. Golly. All right, man. I'll let somebody else win it, man. I'll let somebody else win it. Hey, man, I'm going to give you Hey, well, somebody got to call me, man. Nobody else called, so, you know, I guess they don't want to try to win anything. So, um, we're getting ready to wrap it up, though, man. I appreciate y'all's support, man. When are y'all closes in prayer, man? Oh, yeah. Oh, hold on, hold on real quick. Hold up, hold up. I got somebody calling in. Hold on. Don't hang up. Don't hang up. Hey, what's going on, y'all, on Forgiven TV? Hello. What's up? The DVD player, I mean the DVD uh, thing you're talking about, right? Yeah. Uh, Street Disciple? Street Disciples, that's it, man. Tell everybody your name, who's this? On Facebook, they know me as Christ Affiliated, but it's Jose. There you go, man. Jose, man, I'm going to hook you up, man. Uh, let me see. Text me your uh, text me your email address or something, Jose, and then I'm going to... Uh, I'm going to uh, send you the download link so you can click on it from your, or send me an email address or something, and I'll send you the download link so you can pull that down tonight and jam that gospel gangsters, man. I appreciate your support, bro. All right. Hey, man, God bless you, man. God bless you, too. Bye. All right, y'all. All right, man, one of y'all, like I said, one of y'all go ahead and close this down in prayer, man. We're going to shut it down. All right, man, I'll close this out in prayer. I did. Dear Heavenly Father, Lord, I just want to thank you, Lord, for uh, another wonderful night, Lord, of uh, a fellowship, Lord. Uh, I, I just thank you, Lord, for uh, allowing us, Lord, to be able to be that that light, Lord, in the community, Lord, uh, using uh, forgiving, forgiving ministry, Lord, using uh, forgiving MCC TV, Lord, out there, Lord, just to, to reach everybody out there. Lord, I just pray, Lord, that you just uh, continue to tell your blessings, Lord, on uh on our ministry, Lord, as well as everybody else out there, Lord, who's uh, who's doing it, Lord, for your for your honor and glory, Lord, I just pray, Lord, uh, blessings, Lord, over uh, gospel gangsters, Lord, I, I pray that you just continue to to just uh, be with their ministry, Lord, as uh, as they continue, Lord, to uh, to make disciples, Lord, and to uh, bring souls, Lord, into your kingdom, Lord, in Jesus' name, I pray, Amen. Amen. Hey, Amen. I appreciate y'all, man. All right, man. Well, we're getting ready to wrap it up, man. I'm going to close it out with that low riding track one more time on that Gospel Gangsters, man. How'd y'all oh, like yeah. that? How'd y'all like that one, man? Oh, man, that's banging, man. That's definitely that West Coast flavor, man, but it's all good. Hey, that's trademark right there for me. Watch. When y'all see me, when y'all see me, y'all going to be hearing that rolling up. <laughs> oh, yeah. If I'm not banging that forgiving track, I'm banging that uh, low riding by gospel gangsters. <laughs> I already called it. Don't be trying to copy me. Don't be trying to copy me, David. <laughs> oh, <man. laughs> 
I told David I was going to do something on my ride, and he was like, man, why you got to copy me? I said, man, you ain't never told me you was going to do that, man. And he was like, but I was thinking about it in the spirit. You copy me. <laughs> you copy me in the spirit, man. <laughs> Crazy, man. What's up? <laughs> like, man, how am I supposed to know? That's just, we just in the spirit, man. We we in the one accord, you know what I mean? He's like, you copying me, man. That's not fair. Like, dang. <laughs> <laughs> All right, man. Y'all be good, man. All right, man. God bless. God bless. All right. Hey, man. All right, y'all. Well, let's see. We're going to shut it down, man. I got this track. We're going to bang one more time on the way out, man. This is that low riding by uh, Gospel Gangsters. Don't forget to go download the new album. It's on iTunes, Amazon, um, and I'm sure it's on mostly any other resource you can get it from, uh, like Xbox Music and all that stuff too, man. But whatever you use to download, go download that new Defenders of the Faith by Gospel Gangsters, man. God bless y'all. Sermons and street races. Who can meet Christ and turn from street life? This sit in church to learn and return to speak life. Long as my heart beat low, I never see the feet. Somebody can't take it, I never let them see the heat. But to live is Christ in the dies of the last. So never get in my way when I come through smash. Tell stories rare told. I take them back to the garden where men's heart was first hard. Nowadays, these first lost. I'm praying they are harking, but the church lights are dark. Cross me, ride. You don't know what you'll be starting. I'm a child of God, never smile when I mile. But catch me on the prowl with a squad. Dick, so many wanna be in the city of Jesus. You know why? Pumping through our DD on D. Don't love the but we pity they please. And if you're scared to ride, we give you the keys. We know why. Top. We from the block. We don't ride. 
And we wanna yes. make this party so high. So we wanna be in the city of G's. No vibe. Bumping through our DDOD. Roll up the stitches, but we get that keys. And if you scared to ride, we get in the keys. We know why. Serious note, hoping you can feel it while you're hearing this book. Fake come out hearing the word, I'm living the verb, and I'll still be standing when they clear the smoke. I ain't afraid to die, ain't no need to cry, cause I know I'm gonna live again. And if you're living in sin, then you're going to the lake, I'ma give it to you straight. Ain't no need me kill my friends, one day it's gonna end. Better repent and fall in. Homie, I know you ball in, but don't you hear it call in, stop stalling. But no man 
Yo, a lot of haters try to move like us. We gladiators. Can't nobody move like us. I'm glad he made us. A troop full of troops like us. And don't worry, I never lose my trust. Lose my touch. I'm cold handicapped when I use my crutch. Burn slower like I use the Dutch. Like Noah moving in tools and such. I stay away from the don't know what's looking for tools to clutch. I'm the chief prince. Step on the scene, ready to gladiate. Rhymes nice and precise, but I still spit mines to Cali West. Call me Maximus, cause they attack it. It's the dame action. And she throws three buses, you need to pack it up. Dominating on the razor trap. Track, track, like a razor back. On the rider, like a raider hat. Just one rhyme, is making them flat. Freaking for y'all because the game is whack. So you can bounce with me, bounce with me, bounce with me. Walk with me, walk with me, walk with me now. Ride with me, ride with me, ride with me. Die with me, die with me, rise with me. Bounce with me, bounce with me, bounce with me. Walk with me, walk with me, walk with me. Ride with me, ride with me, ride with me. Die with me, die with me, rise with me. When they wanna get in the zone, they slapping on me. Or when they just chillin', slapping bones with their homies, they bumpin' me. They wanna hear it from a G, spitting game from the streets. How I came with the heat, can't change the streets, but I can show change me. Still let the back hang low, swing three. We hang deep at the A shack. We skate lax and stay backs. Let's see the Mac attack to see where it's fake back. Wanna ride with me? Huh? You wanna roll with me? Shit's for souls with me. You can spit the gold with me. Can't roll with me if you gon' be stutter stepping. Coming at him like I'm avenging my brother's death, and I'm tucking my weapon. To this brother stuck in deception, I'm interrupting the session while busting, clutching my weapon. It's spiritual war, and you'll never hear it before. We're hear it again, cause it's made for spiritual win. Wanna roll with me? Roll with me. Get the dough with me, fish the souls with me, you can spit the gold with me, bounce with me, bounce with me, then roll with me, fish the souls with me, you can spit the gold with me, bounce with me, bounce with me, bounce with me, walk with me, walk with me, walk with me now, ride with me, ride with me, ride with me, die with me, die with me, rise with me. City came to make the club jump, ain't no need to dump, homie, you can keep the heat in the trunk, we keep it gangster, but the eight way. After the eighth day, the eighth straight, shaking the world as we gladiate. Keeping the faith, city mind, bringing the heat to your face. One and all, not a piece of the cake. Spit that raw to y'all, visit my way. Keep the gangster, homie. You can have, but you never can. Y'all heard me the first time with the.